Pulling Motor by Miriam Sarsia Saunders. Hurry, we're late for school. I have a spinning motor inside me that buzzes and whirls and hums. I can't turn it off. It made me play with my dinosaurs instead of getting my shoes on this morning. At school, my motor made me wiggle too much during story time. I touched the teacher's scissors and I talked out of turn, whirling, spinning, humming. At recess, my friends wouldn't play with me because my buzzing motor's noises were too annoying. So I threw a hard ball and hit Nicole in the face. By mistake, ouch, sorry Nicole. The twirling and humming made me forget my snack and my lunch and my homework. At home, the motor ran me fast around the dining table, running and running and running, round and round. Mum told me to slow down, take it easy, but I couldn't turn off the motor. So Dad had me sit down and he plunked a box of blocks in front of me. Up, up and up I kept going, higher and higher. I made a tower so high it almost hit the ceiling. Time for dinner. Charlie, dinner, now. Mum and Dad came to get me. They had mad faces. Now it's time for bed. Dad chases me twice around the sofa. Mum tells me to brush my teeth. Bedtime. But I can't sleep. I have a spinning motor inside me that buzzes and whirls and hums. Mum tucks me in and I squiggle and squirm because the motor is busy. Hey there, wiggle worm. I know it's hard for you to settle down. You always move, move, move. But I need to talk to you. Uh-oh, will she tell me all the things I did because of my buzzing motor? I bury my head under a blanket. I wish I could turn off the motor. She takes out a sparkly red notebook and reads from a list. Wonderful list. Took your cereal bowl to the sink without being asked. Said thank you when I gave you a glass of milk. Your teacher said you sat still during spelling and finished your math. You shared markers with Isabel and Miles. You held the door open for Hayden. You ate all your peas and broccoli. You put your blocks away. You got into your jammies for Dad much quicker today. You brushed your teeth the first time I told you to. And I'm very proud of you. My buzzing, twirling, humming motor settles to a quiet purr and a warm, cosy yumminess spreads. I like this feeling. Mum ruffles my hair. You did all that today. I wrote it down to remind us all how wonderful you are. I bet I'll catch you doing all sorts of wonderful things tomorrow too. I dig down into my warm covers I guess my motor is a little sleepy after all. Dad says good night. Mum kisses my forehead. They think I'm wonderful. What will be on my wonderful list tomorrow? Good night.